a video of this bovine placenta. So Dorothy just calved. I have a video of her passing this placenta, which we consider the third stage of parturition or calving. So the first stage is um, getting that cervix to open up. The second stage is the calf actually being expelled. And the third stage of parturition or calving is them passing the placenta. This should be passed within eight to 12 hours of really maybe pushing it in a cow. Um, she passed this in about two hours, a little under two hours, she pushed this out. So. Good job, Dorothy. It's been a little while since I had some uh, reproductive anatomy. <laughs> so I will do my best to explain the bovine uterus to you guys. So think of this as the calf came out, ripped through it, and the calf was inside of this um, placenta, so the or fetal membranes. Um, so these would have been the vessels and arteries that were connecting the calf to the cow. And what I'm going to do is show you the outside of this. So you can see all these little buttons here, right? So those are actually called um, cotyledons. And cotyledons are the fetal membrane or the calf side of the attachment to the cow. So um, I'll, I'll flip those out and show you guys what those look like. So how the placenta attaches in the cow is the... Um, cow has the, it's what it's called a caruncle, and the calf side is the cotyledon, and they are basically like Velcro. Those two stick together like this, and each one of these little patches is a Velcro patch between the calf, the placenta, and the cow uterus. Um, and so the cotyledon and the caruncle together is called a placentome. And so the bovine uterus has about 120 to 125 of these placental attachments. That make sense? Okay, so. Next one I want to do is flip one of these out. So I'm gonna put my arm in here and flip this out to show you these placental attachments here. So if you're like a vet student who's having to um, study any of this, it's how I remember it is mom is older and so she's got a driving li driver's license. So mom drives the car, which would be still in Dorothy out there, and the, cat um, the Catalina part of it, of the attachment, is the calf side. So mom drives the car, car uncle, calf has the Catalina. Um, anyway. So this is the attachment right here. And like I said, this was like Velcro onto the inside of that cow. Um, so this is just a beautiful placenta. Um, the, if you had this in the uterus, whatever side she ovulated out of and had the CL will be the larger side of this. So you can see those beautiful placental attachments there. Um, and this is already starting to disintegrate here. I'll try to flip it out gently for you guys. So you can see that horn there. Can you still see that? Yeah. Beautiful. So I've totally flipped this inside out. So this would be the side that the calf was attached to, if that makes sense. And you can see this beautiful amount of vessels running through here. Supplying this uterus with all of the nutrients it needed to make a beautiful heifer calf. So, 
that's it. That's the bovine placenta. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you have any questions, drop them in the comments. I will do my very, very best to answer those. So, yay, baby calves.